Thanks, Karen. Just a, a follow-up on the Social Security stuff as it relates to the debt ceiling. Um, recently, HHS announced some proposed rates for Medicare Advantage that would result in a $3 billion reduction to the program. I know Becerra pushed back on that characterization, but can you explain how does it square with the President's commitment not to cut Medicare, or are there cost-saving measures in there somehow in the, the broader program that you wouldn't characterize as a cut if it's a cost-saving measure? I, I mean, I'm not going to go beyond to what the Secretary Becerra said. What he said is basically what, where the President is. Uh, I, I, I want to be very careful here uh, because, and as you know, the President's going to put forth his budget on March 9th, and he'll talk about uh, what he thinks is fiscally uh, responsible and put forth a budget that's fiscally responsible. And, uh, and he mentioned this in the State of the Union. He's going to talk about how he's going to uh, continue to lower the deficit by $2 trillion, and you guys will see uh, the, the specifics of that, of that uh, budget when it comes out. And let's not forget, the President also uh, lowered the deficit the first two years by $1.7 trillion. So the, all of that is important as the president is growing the economy and making sure that no one is left behind, uh, that he's also lowering the deficit. And he's doing that with these very historic pieces of legislation that we have seen him uh, sign into law these, this past uh, two years. But I want to be very clear. Um, when it comes to uh, when it comes to protecting Medicare, when it comes to Social Security, the president is going to continue to fight to make sure uh, that those are not uh, being held hostage uh, by the Republican Party. To make sure that we are fighting for uh, programs that tax ta taxpayers, pardon me, pay into. We're talking about veterans. We're talking about seniors. Uh, so this is something that the president has been very clear about. He talked about it this week. He talked about it at the State of the Union. Uh, we need to make sure those. those those programs, those life-saving programs uh, for many Americans, millions of Americans, uh, are not uh, played with just like what Republicans are trying to do. I just laid out moments ago how Republicans have been talking about for years, for years, how they want to cut those really key programs uh, for our veterans, for our seniors. And so the President, again, is going to continue to fight for, for those. Thank you.